Hello, there are a lot of questions about how to make calibration of the BioWell device, of the EPI GDV device. So now I'm going to demonstrate you how to do that. Before pressing the start button, please take care about the following things. So there is a rubber band around the metal cylinder inside. So what you have to do is to press it as far as it's possible inside of it. So it won't touch the uh, glass electrode when you will be doing the calibration. Next thing is that you take this calibration tool for the place, uh, in the place where the wire is being plugged in, and then you pull it so this maximally press the spring inside. Uh, in this way, you can put this calibration uh, plug into the device. So, in this way you won't scratch the glass electrode. Only doing like this. Maximum pull. After that, when you put it inside, what you should do to make it absolutely evenly uh, position on the glass electrode is that you can rotate it and press forward as it is shown on this picture. So how it will look on in the BioWell software. So when you press start, you see that there is too much noise inside of the uh, uh, in a circle. So it means that you should rotate and push forward the wire to adjust it. So you see I pushed a little bit, yeah, so now it's the best position, so it's clear inside, that is the best position to make calibration. After you have done that, you have to wait until uh, the program finishes, but as long as in the beginning there were not correct images, you have to press stop and start once again right from the first image with the white inner circle. So in this way your calibration will be done perfectly. So then all the rest will be done automatically. You can go and have your coffee or tea and the program will do everything itself. So it can take several cycles because it calculates the overall area of the glow and uh, if it's not in the standard level it increases or decreases the level of voltage of the device it's all being done automatically you just have to wait until the program finishes it in some cases it takes several cycles for the program to adjust the uh, voltage so you will see that the area of glow will be uh, increasing or decreasing depending on the air conditions in which you are working and you simply have to wait until it adjusts the voltage and then make the captures again to calculate the average value. So after the calibration has been made the preview of the glow should disappear from your screen and you will see this table. So if everything has gone perfect there will be no problems here no marking in red nothing so you have to simply click apply after that the device will be ready for measurements of fingers so we will wait until it will is applied look it's written here please wait so just I, the uh, information has, uh, is being sent to the server so now we see that calibration is complete now we can go to the full scan and start working with people thank you for your attention